Hey, pretty thing. I'm gonna drop my bag in the back, okay? I just need to deal with Trevor real quick. Thanks. Promise it won't take long. Can I get a little kiss for good luck? Guy is driving me up the wall. Yeah. And I know I smell like french fries. <laughs> I'll shower ASAP, I know. Say, how do you feel about taking a little drive, sweetheart? You know, I know you're right. We do have school in the morning. <laughs> I still think I'd really like that drive, though. Here, let me take the wheel. Huh? Oh, it's it's just a little ketchup. Don't, you, don't worry about it. <laughs> I said... Don't worry about it, okay? They were being assholes, alright? I took a swing and that was it. Don't worry about it. Really? Don't worry about it. I just said that. Let's just drive, okay? I just want to spend time with my cute, sweet partner and relax. Who you texting? Your mom, huh? Good. That's really responsible. You're a responsible person, sweetheart. Oh, and oh, so considerate. I know she worries. I know. Big, scary goth girlfriend comes trudging up behind their little good student. They had to be pissing themselves. Oh, no. No, no. I think it's nice that I can hang out for game night these days. I thought your dad was just waiting for an excuse to toss me out, but hey, we get on now, don't we, baby? Thick as thieves. Just two people wanting to protect the person they love the most. <laughs> I know you love me, too. You've always been good to me, even when I was a moody little loner that insisted she didn't want any friends. Certainly not some pristine angel, and you've never tried to fix me, which I appreciate. Probably a lot more than I let on. Have... Have you ever loved something so much that... The idea of losing it makes you panic? Not just sweat nervously or fret, but... <laughs> it gives you legitimate panic attacks. Makes you feel like the entire universe is coming down on you. I... I love you too, baby. I... I know you wouldn't leave me. Trevor didn't know that, though. I heard him and the other... Bastards that I worked with. They were calling you awful names, dear. They wanted to gang up on you at school and... Hurt you. You know I'd never have done it otherwise, right? Oh... I guess I did skip over that detail. <laughs> yeah, um, I did tell you that I'm a little crazy, right, baby? Come here, huh? Come snuggle up against your big, strong girlfriend. <laughs> you and me, we understand each other. We're comfortable with each other. I know I can tell you anything. <laughs> You like the smell of my body wash. <laughs> Thanks. You know, wearing this dumb uniform when you're my size and ripped to shit makes me feel pretty silly. Especially at the fucking soccer moms that come through. You'd be so pretty without those piercings and eyeliner. <laughs> Just because their mar husbands can't get them off. But hey, you don't need to worry about that once we're married, huh? So... Do you want to know what I did to them? Or are you really sure? <laughs> well, when I heard Trevor talking shit, the restaurant was deserted, so I figured I'd had some leeway. The cameras don't work anymore. They're just for show. I waited until Josh and Tyler had gone out to sneak a cig. Then I dragged Trevor to the deep fat fryer and, well, <laughs> it's amazing how long it takes someone's skin to melt off their face, you know. 
I figured it'd be a lot faster. It wasn't, unfortunately, and the other stew just came in while he was some sort of flopping fish. <laughs> yeah, pretty gruesome. I choked Tyler out while Josh tried to pull me off. If he had just run, I'd, I'd have let him go. But he had to try and be all machismo, try and save his bro. Had to cut their throats. Cleanup took a long time. Had almost finished by the time you got there. Was really lucky you didn't come in for your usual. Are you scared, sweetheart? <laughs> just a little? Just a little? You wouldn't rat me out, right? That's my baby. That's one nice thing about having a rich, estranged dad. He can make all of this go away, and we can all move on. And hey, the cabin is open this weekend. This month, actually. What do you say, sweetheart? A nice, relaxing month at the cabin? Good. Because snuggling with you is, <laughs> well, it's sublime. And I think I need it right now. I'm not feeling particularly stable. <laughs> Don't worry, sweetie. I'm going to take care of you. I love you so, so much.